WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough shows us the big drop in disciplinary incidents. Chanel Smith will be a sophomore at Paul W. Bryant High School in Tuscaloosa. She says she enjoys going to school to learn. She's glad to hear fewer of her peers are getting into trouble. Because people grew up and started to act the age and they learned a lesson. Tuscaloosa City Schools says the overall number of disciplinary incidents in the district dropped from around 3,000 a year in 2012 to about 1,800 now. School leaders say they have to do more than just discipline students. You can suspend them, you can put them out of school, but did you actually help that child? The district focused on creating activities that make students more excited about coming to school, such as attending special classes at the Tuscaloosa Career and Technology Academy. Also making sure students have positive role models and mentors to talk to about any problems they have. Even the janitors got involved. You know, everybody has to buy into this program. Of course, missing school because of bad behavior can have huge academic consequences in the long run. Something Smith says can be hard to recover from. It's a zero in the grade book for every day you're gone. So like you get suspended for 10 days, you get 10 zeros every day you're out. In Tuscaloosa, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13. School leaders also plan to look at improving the district's attendance rate, which they say goes hand-in-hand -hand with discipline.